optimistic about getting the ball back, but that made it a lot easier. Yeah. Oh, we're playing flings. <laughs> Isn't that hot? An Aryan? <laughs> uh, I think we've just walked into an Aryan. He's only, he's only streaming this, you know. He is. <laughs> oh, no. Oh, change the uh, title again, mate. See if you can get anybody to tune back in. Don't know if people don't like watching my team play. <laughs> but yes, that looked alright. No, no, they are missing your comments outside of the game while you're playing. Has to be. <laughs> yeah, let's go with that. Mm. Easy L, thank you very much for the host. Cheers, buddy. Isn't Chef going to be super effective? Yeah, it fucking is. What's the uh, the team value of the flings? Uh, Two twenty underneath us. Uh, right, so it gets a chef and yeah, something else. A chef and something, yeah. Yeah, this is... Um... This is going to be painful. Well, it's, it could go two ways. You could pick up a Bangladesh of star player points, the three die blocks on flings by vampires, just getting casualty after casualty. Or, yeah. you'll completely fail to knock them down, and we'll just skip round us. Yeah. Um, we could whisper it loose. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, this is not a good well, matchup. We've got naturally four re-rolls, so they can't take them all. But <laughs> we... We need at least four anyway, don't we? You'd, would you yeah. consider going to a fifth re-roll for, for vamps? I think I probably would. Yeah. You can receive. Proba probably not. You'll end up having pro and dodge and other skill re-rolls. You won't need... It's in the beginning you need the most re-rolls before you have all those fun things. Right, so our best two players, weirdly, in this game are the two block linemen. Um, what we can do is we can space the vampires out a bit. Because right. we don't need to contain the trees. Are we calling this a rematch? <laughs> no, stream snipe. To be fair, he was playing flings anyway, so he hasn't sniped you. This is just happy coincidence. It's a shame you yeah, didn't get fine. Sage, to be honest. And, uh, yes, for reference, currently the best halfling record is 505. And it's not an Orion, it's another Swedish player. He was five. He was five. 2-2, two, two, which is better than 505, isn't it? When we asked him yesterday. Yeah, but good day before. Yeah, What's, um, well, how how far behind is Anarion? I mean, we may have lost a game or two since we played yeah. our friendly. Didn't you play that friendly before the Champladner opened? <laughs> did it was it was it was it was what day is it Thursday? It was Tuesday night. It was last game Tuesday. He has played one and drawn. <coughs> oh, Gruff's, Gruff's correct. Narin's record I'm thinking of was in the open ladder. Thanks, Gruff. Yep, of course it was. This is, of, this is of course, Champ Ladder Aardvark. We, we, only, we only really want to play Champ Ladder and uh, private league games. That, yep. uh, that open league nonsense was only because Champ Ladder was shut. So we're back in the proper games now. Yeah. Oh, I tell you what, he's only nicked off with our strip as well. He has, hasn't he? It's not nailed down. Jeez, he's going to have it. Do you know what? I'm, and final thought. I know you're loath to discuss anything about my games and Thanks. the worst pundit ever, by I the way. I do. Worst pundit. I think, mean, thank God Pidpad was here, otherwise, we'd have just been talking about what you had for lunch. Pizza. Me, I mean, I keep it on topic, always totally focused. <laughs> um. <laughs> 
Oh, I, what I would say is I'm really glad I took two heads on Bull Goat rather than uh, Sure Hands. But although Sure Hands will, will be a thing, two heads on a goat. <sighs> Might need a bit more of that. Really. Yes, you, yes, yes, you do. If, if there's something I learned when playing Underworld is that two heads is amazing on any player. Yes. So, you clock that, Andy. We, we like two heads on at least one goat. Okay. The sweeper and the ball carrier should have two heads, at least. Yes, I, I think I'll make one of my sweepers a two-header. Thanks. Rama said, uh, yes, easily. It's when um, a coach uh, who has the ball um, can't um, defend it properly, so what he does is send the ball ahead into the opponent's uh, direction. Um, and just relies on him not getting knocked over with no other no other screen or cage or anything like that. Sometimes you have to. You don't like it, but sometimes you have to. Sometimes it's least worst option, yeah. That's right. And uh, also, s since when did I manage to keep on topic? Well, you talked about my game code and I didn't like that. It used to be all about me. <laughs> um... Yeah, it, it, the honestly asked what happened in my game. Um, we stopped taking annoying casualties and were starting to pressure the ball, pushing the ball carrier deep backwards. Um, eventually, uh, my opponent made a, a very ambitious pass. I think we'd have got the ball anyway, but happily enough, one of my Chaos Warriors intercepted it. And so, no, we went to 1-0. Uh, and secured not getting relegated. And secured not getting relegated. I don't think Chibberson was in full try-hard mode. He was in sort of wind-down end of the season. I'm re-rolling this team mode. So it, it went all right. It was a tough start. I wasn't sure we were going to manage that when the first half had gone. No, the first half was, let, let's call it, ungood. We <laughs> got beat up by bigger boys. Andy, we seem to have got Henry Judas and Morbid Orbits knocked out already. We have, unfortunately, yeah. So you're getting beaten up by flings. Yep. Want, want, want a pro tip? Go on. What's that? Stop doing that. <laughs> so what's, what's Willow supposed to be, then? Move five, strength four, agility three. Oh, it's just shit. Oh, like no, no, it's well, just shit. He's, he, he's a Nurgle warrior, isn't he? No, he's not. He's like a chaos warrior with a move bust, or...? Uh, that's a dryad. I used that as Bretonian in a game against dwarves. It was actually quite good. Um, he doesn't have block or dodge. He's a bit of a victim, surely. Destronoff, thank you very much. Yeah, I think I think you're probably right, mate. It, it did. Strength four sidestep is quite good. Yeah, I suppose. And it was something to stick on the line of scrimmage as well. As there's plenty of armor. And a fairly cheap star as well. So you couldn't afford Buffy stroke Zara? Well, I couldn't afford a wizard. If I recall correctly, or I might have had that under wizard or something. Uh, Excel, that that was the last game of the season. Um, in that was Division Two A. Um, so we are currently third. There are other teams that could pass us in the last uh, couple of games, but with all the rerolls going on with Legendary out, we might get promoted into um, Division One could happen. Well, t to be honest, halfway through the season we, we were looking very favourable to get promoted, but then we had those couple of games that were just um, spectacularly bad. But, uh, yeah, it fin finished okay. Be gentle. Be gentle. Oh, Hellboy got knocked out. That never happens. It's becoming a theme with Hellboy, isn't he? It's like he's, he's not a good kisser. I think he like lunges in and smashes his forehead against the vampire and bang. Three players down, this is going to be really difficult. 
it's um, really, really difficult. <clears throat> hmm. What do you think? It flings for a bit. See what happens. Because he will try and throw it, I think. And Arian does like tossing... Uh, oh, God, I can't believe what I'm just about to say. He does like tossing half halflings around. <laughs> That's... As it was, the words were forming on my lips. I thought, oh god, what am I saying? I think I got away with it. Yeah, no one noticed. No, it's fine. This, uh, this Andy Pineapple tree is a little dynamic, isn't he? He doesn't care. No. Uh, XL, oh, mate, I, the two leagues I've played in are, um, for a long term have been Orca Cola. And UKBBL, and I, I really like both of them. The good, good communities. The competition is um, at the bottom end. It's welcoming the new coaches, but at the top end, there's amongst the best blood bowl players um, I've come across. I mean, there, there are obviously excellent blood bowl players who don't play in those competitions, but to win either of them is bloody hard work. Yeah, but that's that's yeah. important. Yeah, and there is actually no one who has won both OCC and UK BBL yet. Yeah, and we're <laughs> 30 seasons in. Funny, funny you should mention that, Fed. I think that's a fact that's not lost on um, our friend here, who has been desperate to try and win OCC. But, <laughs> High Elves, no. Hey, I won OCC with High Elves. If we had to pick one, ooh, it's a tough what, call. Which is harder, uh, OCC, probably. No, no, no. I mean, it, Muir says if you had to choose one. I, I'd narrowly Orca Cola, but only because it was the one I was in first. I, I used to be a director in it. I've been an admin in it. I'm, I, I'm on the, the retired director's council now, which sounds awfully grand. But basically, it just means we don't do anything anymore. It, I've got a lot of sentiment. And the, the guys who originally set it up... Um, Pid padding, in, in, uh, including that, are all bloody good blokes. You know, I, I still regularly speak to Zephyr, even though we don't play games anymore, and an endless amount of time for Doomy and Ray and all the gang. But UK Bubble is is pretty bloody close. Didn't even fucking break it on. After the game I've just had, mate, I can sympathise. But I had Claw Mighty Blow going on. <laughs> at least, at least uh, Scab managed to find his form towards the end and, uh, and got one. Oh, Plenty Houston, thank you for the host. Oh, cheers, man. I'm still not sure who that daft lad is in the hat with the sword. It's all very confusing, that. He's got it all going on. It's like a LARP football hooligan. Probably another of Andy's neighbours. It probably is actually. <laughs> I, I don't know his name though. Hawkeye, run, run for your life. Don't go in the woods. Shall we call him Bob, just to follow my naming policy? We could do. We've got Ron and Linda's on one side, so is Bob on the other? Yeah. I, I mean, if you don't know someone's name, it's Bob. Well, unless <laughs> you're in Sweden. Unless it's in Sweden, because then it's Oedu. But that would be lost on most people anyway. Yeah, bless well, you. Would be, it, would, it would be Bjorn, wouldn't it? It's no. most, most Swedish folks are called Bjorn. And then they have the son of Bjorn, which is Bjorn Bjornsson. Well, you've got the tennis land, you've got the lad out of Abba. They're both Bjorn. Yes. Yeah. Uh, you're right, this is totally different to the last matchup because he's kicked the fuck out of our team. Not surprising, it's Armour 7 versus um, Two Mighty Blow. Um, but he got two removals on the first turn. I removed one and he's removed one. So I'm playing four players uphill. It, it's bloody hard work. Well, you don't want me at half time to go down and take issue with the ref and say, bigger boys took our lunch money off us and then yeah, having us just look at me with their halflings. <coughs> I, I, I can't sell that, man. Don't make me do it. 
but there's nothing I can do. I'm so far so far behind with player numbers now. Very little we can do about it. Should uh, hypnotise some more halflings because we can. Um. Oh no, Beasley. The other one's called Benny. He was the lad with the beard. Got one. Got one on his turn. It's very Got good. One. Oh, and it's vampire star player points. That, Yay. that rare commodity. Yeah, they are rare, they are. <laughs> He's just written in the chat free star player points. Thanks very much, Anarian. All free star player points I gladly received. Just having a look, is there any conceivable way we can reach the ball? No. <laughs> You're playing vampires. There is a conceivable way, always. We need two vamps to do it. Where's 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 vamp number three? Is he not lying out, down? So? No, he's lying down. Thing is, you don't have enough time to actually figure it out. Mm. I play this game fairly quickly, but vampires, no. Uh. All right, the only way I can see you getting the ball, should you want to, is that easternmost halfling gets hypnogazed and then line down Vampus and dodges and go for it to blitz the ball, but it's not very optimal. I'd say continue to harass Harry and be in the way would probably be better. Hmm. I'm gonna go. I was trying to go for let's, let's hit some halflings. Hmm. See, three dice blocks are brilliant, except when you roll those three dice, it's not what you want. Yeah, they're the, they're the wrong three dice, aren't they? Yeah. Oh, we've got a block. We've got our block guy back. Uh, Ablin, yes, this is Champ Ladder. I don't know why they put pants on the tree. The tree could have just done without any clothes at all, couldn't it? Oh, well. Oh, where we uh, go? I, I, I can tell you why. It's so you can tell what team trees are playing for. If there's different uh, okay. teams with tree men. And you, okay. you don't want an indiscreet branch hanging out here and there, do you? No. It's a family-friendly game. It is. It's absolutely. It's family. Is, is it Quite really? Right, We'd have that Anita Sarkeesian ringing up all full of hell, wouldn't we? Yeah, that's actually a really good tree, Brute. That stalls the, tr uh, the drive a bit. Oh, oh pseudonym, I can help you out here. And um, if you opened a bakery, you'd be Bjorn and Bread. Oh, God. <laughs> God. I can't believe Advart's missing this. This is right up his street. It is, isn't it? Now, it is. I don't know if Anarian's in the stream or not. Be, I think you should be renamed Glenn. Because, as everyone knows, everyone from Gothenburg is called Glenn. <laughs> and Gothenburg is the Swedish capital of Hans. I was not aware of that. Um, I pref I personally prefer the four blitz and no witch elf start uh, neon and definitely prefer that start in a league. Um, what it is personal preference? Oh, is that tree going to fall over? It is. Is it going to fall over? Fall over. It is. Now, now there's an interesting one. So I went with my replay. I can't get rid of the last little bit of bar that I'm lagging behind somewhere here. Stop again. Oh, that! I tell you what, she, she she's a bit of a value for money, isn't she, an old Anita? She's a very angry woman, from what I've seen. You know, um, you know, Boogie Two Nine Eight. What's it? 
nice big big fella nice nice guy she shouted at him at that conference and all she was up to me Gamergate, that, that was it when she was, uh, that was all happening a couple of years ago, wasn't it? Mm. Mm. Not seen that one, Serene Cicero. And anybody else seen it where you, you get a bug where you didn't get a chance to oppo an injury um, on a foul? Destin off, yeah. I think she, she is quite furious, isn't she? You wouldn't, uh, you wouldn't want to get the wrong side of her. Oh, oh excuse me, a sec. I am going to make a cup of tea and feed the cat. I shall be one minute. Okay, so we've got two dice on the ball. I think I am actually going to leave you. Okay. E e e even if it's interesting, but... Right, we will re-roll. There he goes. And knocked out he is. Where'd the ball go? Oh, fuck off. Ugh, oh, them's the brakes. Ah, oh, dearie me. Okay, so the tree's not stood up, and the other one's rooted. Um, but what he can do uh, is broadly just run that got uh, that halfling. Luckily for me, he's not in currently in scoring range. Um, but. Um, doesn't necessarily mean that he uh, can't get chain pushed there or something else crazy might happen. But he certainly could just run and be annoying and just be stood sort of here. Um, and that, that fact won't be lost on an Aryan. Um, brave call using Willow there. Um, and what I tried to do was have a deliberately have a physical wall of players to, to hem him in. Um, I wasn't expecting, annoyingly, that halfling to catch the ball. I was thinking it'll land somewhere in here, um, and then it'll be difficult for him to get through. How right I was, not. And we're back. What have I missed? Uh, we knocked out the ball carrier, but then another halfling caught it, and um, he's now dodging away and being annoying. Oh. Oh, he's oh, fallen over. Oh, look. oh, 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 oh. This yeah. is big. He's properly fallen over. Canal, wow. Oh, he's dead. He's dead, oh, dear. look. Oh, he's dead. That's not good. Oh, no, be alright. Okay. Well, that's. So. Turn up for the books, that one. It's cat amongst the pigeons, that, isn't it? Absolutely is, yeah. Right. So we need to move. We need to move a half uh, a vampire near the ball. One, two, three, four, five, six. So you can stand there. <coughs> Which do bug reports? I think it's on the cyanide focus blood bowl forum. Is there anywhere better than that? Do we know? Five, one, two, three. Uh, no. It's turn five. Do a blitz here. Serene Cicero, if you if you log on to Blood Bowl Forum, um, 
and have a look to the, the, the section there, buddy. One, two, three, four, five, six. Okay, so I was just making sure that we don't block our own route off there uh, when we move this vampire to try and pick the ball up. Um, but it turns out we haven't. We've got two dice block here, which we can still take because um, there's a f line down thrall, and I will take that. I'll use the reroll. Unbelievable, Jeff. You're still hoping to pilot the. Oh, be gentle now. Gentle. There, that was alright. Um, you still hoping to pilot the pitch and snatch a touchdown here, right? Yeah. Yes. Now, almost for me, it might be worth. I dodge you out. So, if I dodge the vamp out, I'm. Nah. If I do that block. Oh, dear, this is difficult. Um, Real purple guy, thank you for the follow. Welcome to the show. Let's do this block. Okay, so um, Anarian can't really get two dice on the ball here. Um, so he can't really, he physically can't get two dice on the ball. Um, I'm lucky that the only tree that's stood up is rooted and the other one is irrelevant because it's lying down. Um, what I suspect we'll now see is Anarian start throwing grenades at me. Um, as in actual halflings thrown at the ball carrier to try and dislodge it. That's the next uh, thing that I'm going to see. Um, we have only got three turns to get down the field, so um, I'm going to need to run up basically full speed for three turns if I want to get there. Um, so maybe Bob Face has got a blitz over the Willow guy, keep running, yeah. and then Councillor at your 10 goes with him and blah. Yeah. So I think we're going to see Anarian just mob us here. <laughs> don't. I'll, t I'll probably take the both down here. Do you know what I'm going to be aware of? Because they're both down. Levels of vampire if he casualties him. It turns him over, and it stops me being hit by the tree. Oh for fuck's sake! <laughs> well, that's still not awful. It, it's an edge for you can do. That. If that, if that was a wood elf, you'd, you'd be all right with that, wouldn't you? Yeah. And you can if you're feeling really bold just block that fling onto the ball yeah might might improve things yeah that's going to be that that's going to be the play here so i don't want this throw getting tied down um that's for after the match so we'll uh, we'll bring him over there that throw can just stand up uh, we can block onto the ball we got lucky but where's it going to go <laughs> Removal now, away from the tree, away from the tree, <laughs> away from the tree. Oh, and, and we do not, we do not want the kind to catch that. Uh, okay, that's, that's that's a bit of an issue. So we'll go back to we'll blitz this. And shatter dice. We've got one. Quality go. blocking. Fargo twin toes. Off you go. Oh, he looks angry, doesn't he, for a fling? Positively furious. Um, Tector's asking, what about uh, hitting over the tree? Yeah, it could work. 
could actually, couldn't you? I was, I was actually more thinking about just whacking things. Um, Steak mittens, good evening. How are you, buddy? Grindle, I think what he does is give him a, a, a little grilled sandwich that um, there's ham, cheese, and then a slice of, uh, of uh, C4 in there. And of course, <laughs> little fuckers neck it down. Um, and everyone's a winner. Um, yes, we're doing okay, mate. The, the vamps have been doing well this evening, and um, in the middle of all that, managed to squeak a win with my Coca Cola Chaos team. So, um, yeah, all good. So, look at that, Grace under pressure. Count backwards, manages it. What a guy. Of course, of course he does. Oh. Are we actually going to throw it now to count slowly at the turn? <laughs> or are we just going to hang on to it? No, we're going to hold on to it. Right. There we go. And what that's going to do is that's going to force the star player to go after one of the two things. Um, and we'll see. We'll see what that... See where he goes. Well, it's going to be an Andy Tree blitz on the ball, I think. So go for it. He can't. He's tr He's rooted. <laughs> well, that's weird. It's not showing rooted on my screen. Oh, it is on the replay. Yeah, you're right. That's bizarre. I wonder if it's... Oh, it may be because I restarted the stream and it bugged out. But yeah, I've got the root symbol there. Well, that's okay. Good. Okay. Um, Tector, yes you do. Um, yeah. you, you have to click on the um, your intended paramour. <coughs> skull, we'll have a skull please, Bob. Great. Well, that was disappointing. Hmm. Right, we are going to need to not roll a one here. Hmm. So, really, I need to throw it to Tomo, and Tomo run off down the field with it. That's basically what needs to happen here. Um, <laughs> and Arian, I don't chat much. Um, not to snipers, no. No. Um, uh, I could hand it off. Right. Um, let's see whether we make bloodlust roll, because that's actually really important. We do. So I can now throw it from there to the other vampire. So count backwards can pass it to uh, to Tomo. Two plus into two plus. Well done. Um, where can you get to? So you can only get to there. GFI gets me to here. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So we've actually got to make this double GFI this turn. Um, the only thing we can do here is could do hypno gaze here. Uh, Zayats, this is Champ Ladder, my friend. This counts. So he's now hypnogazed, that's good. Which means I can move the thrall 
one, two, three, four, five, six. So we could put the thrall in scoring range just to give us a threat and give me a thrall that he can't do anything against. And then we need to make a double GFI. Do you need to make a double jet? Well, let's see whether we roll the bloodlust. We don't. Good. So now it's just double GFI. Top tip, by the way, if you're playing vampires, folks, um, is if you are going to move somewhere, um, but the destination depends on whether or not bloodlust triggers, the, the moment you move one square, you find out whether or not he's passed his bloodlust test. Uh, blood lust test. So you'll see a lot of experienced um, vamp coaches will take one step and then pause and then carry on. <laughs> Zayat, thank you very much. Very sweet of you to say so. I love your time. There we go. Okay. So, um, it's no by no means done and dusted. I'm going to need three two pluses next turn. I need because I can't afford the bloodlust roll realistically. Um, I certainly can't afford a failed GFI. So what we'll try and do is 30 Bob Face needs to go and stand next to the end zone and then I'll walk past him. Yeah, it's, it's what you got to do, isn't it? Yeah. This, this, this is why a smattering a pro and... Um, how many rerolls did he snap up from us? Can you remember? Uh, two. Oh. Okay, so he knocked yeah. himself out. Oh, something good. It's very. That means he can't do anything mega dangerous to us now. I don't think. Okay, so he's making us roll an extra. What's well, it? He'll probably take the both down here. Yep. Huh. Okay, so standing him up doesn't actually help me because I need him to be stood in this square here. But we will run him broadly towards the end zone. Why not? Um, there are no flings left stood up that we can get with block. So, I mean, the, the choice was you could have made two go for it's with him, but that would be probably riskier than a single bloodlust. Yeah. So really, you could have just left him where he was and hoped for the best. One in six. Yeah. Yeah, I was a little. I was a. I don't know. Li little fortunate. Three, three, two pluses. I'm just going to lob that through Samba. So we can tell you how how lucky I was there or not. So three two pluses. That was fifty seven percent. You just rolled triple six there. I think so. Oh no, hang on. Halfling Master Chef. He rolled triple six. Why has he just stole three rerolls this half now? He just got five out of six rerolls. Yeah. Triple. He rolled triple six. Oh, I, have, I haven't seen that roll yet. Yeah. I'll have a look at the luck when it comes back. Stunty hot dog tellers, halfling master chef, four plus six plus six oh, yeah. plus six. <laughs> so I, yeah, he stole five out of six rerolls. Lovely. And then he rolled uh, a five plus, uh, sorry, a five, a six, and a four for a bunch of four pluses for uh, <laughs> KO recoveries. Way to roll some dice, baby. Um, is pro necessary in all the vamps? On, on all the vamps, um, it's helpful. Um, but you probably take <coughs> other skills earlier. So yeah. later, later on, um, when they've got block dodge as a bare minimum, and a couple have got tackle, and maybe one's got mighty blow, you'd, you'd consider pro. Yeah, absolutely. Because what one of the things that hammers through your rerolls, of course, is the um, the necessary bloodlusts. So no, you're on the right lines there, mate. Right. Okay, so I'm going to try and score quite quickly here because um, while we will try and knock over the halflings that are available to us, um, it's important that we try and score quickly.
Yeah, because stopping the flings scoring if uh, really odd work. starts throwing them. Well, we, we, we've no tackle, so um, they can just run past us. Um, the only thing we've got to hope is that we can either injure enough or keep him far enough back that they can't reach, because they are, they are quite slow. I'm, I'm, I'm still not sure exactly how an Aryan w will go. I, I guess it's advance the trees a few paces and then look to throw a fling. Because, of course, uh, trees and halflings are much better ballistically than uh, trolls and goblins. Lose a turn, that's actually good for me in as much as um, I'm, already, I'm currently winning already and um, I've only got one reroll, so I've now only got that one reroll over seven turns, not over eight turns. Yeah. He's just going to have to make do with a six. <laughs> so he's going to pick a turn where he doesn't use a reroll. Nasty. Didn't get the knock. It didn't get the the, uh, the casualty. So I need to protect my block thrall because my block thrall is my most valuable player, arguably more valuable. Um, oh, you hear that, Shadow Dice? You are the most important man on the team. Mm, the vampires don't look very pleased about that. <laughs> okay, right. Go on, kill it. Yes, there we go. Well done. Bonus casualty. Well, the Thrall's doing a cracking job levelling up. We just need the Vamps to try and keep pace. Is this fourth game or third game of the Vamps? Uh, third. Not sure, actually. Yeah, it is the third. The 2-0 two, the two and o coming in at this, isn't they? We only start tonight. Okay. So we've had two MVPs. No, we've had four MVPs because didn't both opponents concede? But all four have been um, onto Thralls, which, I mean, the Thralls outnumber the Vamps more than two to one, so it's not yeah. incredible that that's happened. Yeah. How many players has he got left? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. So he's got nine. How many have we got? One, two, Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. So we got ten. So that that casualty that turn actually did mean that we've got um, a play a one player advantage. Okay. Um, I am. Um, yeah, I was gonna say I've only got one reroll, so I'm trying to do. I don't. I did a lot that turn. Um, I'm trying to just be careful with my with my turns I'm not surprising Arians managed to base our block guy with the tree <coughs> even in Hellboy You uh, good news, Hellboy. You are still alive. You do like getting knocked out, but you are still alive. In fact, where where is Hellboy? I don't know actually. Right, where can you get to? Oh, he's knocked out. <laughs> Yeah, Dy Dynamo's quite right. The pro is is not super reliable. It's um, it's it's a luxury on vampires that when you've got the, the key skills already, it helps a bit. It's it's not your um, ultimate solution, is it? Absolutely. Get careful with that. Oh, uh, <laughs> um, no, I mean the solution to bloodlust problem, not <laughs> only other perceived problems. <laughs> oh come on, he can't. <laughs> 
70 odd years later, he can't have copyrighted <laughs> that phrase. No? Alright, let's see if he dodges. He does. And quite right, Frank, it, the, the thing you're alluding to wasn't exactly ultimate solution. It, it was just synonymous. Frank, in chat, Frank said what the actual thing you're referring to was called. Anyway, moving quickly along. <laughs> yeah, we, we're not bringing that up again. Right, so, bite teammate, I get the choice here. Um, and I'll have that one. So let me conserve the fling. Do you, do you think the vampire's got this little bit of Barry White, you know, sort of, uh, oh, baby. Right, we're pushing the fling off because it's all about numbers at this stage. The more we get rid of, the easier this whole thing becomes. Um. Frank, I'm not talking about it. You're not going to make it happen. So I'm not talking about it. <laughs> oh, God, yeah. Old Bogo Drumfoot there is in a little world of cake and sausages, all his own, isn't it? He's <laughs> gone to this happy place. <laughs> oh, Vraxius. <laughs> <laughs> See what Braxius just said, suck on my chocolate salty thralls. <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, he's he's stunned. Good. No, it's fine. Morbid Orbits is actually only stunned this time, not knocked out, which is good. Why don't we have a capital M on Morbid Orbits? Because it's only a morbid orbit, not a um, massive orbit. When Orion, we'll All not right. be pleased with that. No, it should be a capital. It's because I paste stuff. If people don't put capitals in their, in their name, then why should they get capitals otherwise? Mm -hmm. Oh, double... Oh, wow. Hello. Re yeah, re-roll that. There we go. Oh, Shatterdice, you star. Totally out fighting that tree there. You could be in a little bit of bother now, mind. What you really need <laughs> is for your old your old pal Count Backwards to hypnotise that tree for you. Yeah. That oh, it's an uncanny dodge. Oh, Bobface, look out, son. I haven't seen Bobface tonight, have we? No, I don't know where he is. D uh, to be fair, Oscar, though, I Isaac Hayes, Barry White, all part of the same genre, wasn't it? It was the sort of the you know, uh, 70s romantic tunes. Same kind of style, isn't it? Yeah. Okay, so an Aryan's left all that over there. Um, we've only got two halflings uh, and the vamp, so we will go for... Three, four, five, six. So I want to run away from the trees because I don't want to get anything anywhere near them. Uh, to be fair, Beezil, I think Barry White might have been within a shout for that South Park gig, other than the fact that he's dead. Um, so that possibly really gifted it to old Isaac. And pseudonym, I'm afraid you're not yet on this team, mate, because um, the list of names was stretching way back. Um, you are on the list, but uh, you not, we've not reached you yet. You will get punted up a bit, though, you know, because you come by regularly in chat. There we go. Right. Oh, well, Oscar, I've forgotten that. Yeah, he, he is um, into Scientology, isn't he, Isaac Hayes? And didn't he uh, withdraw his services because uh, the show was taking the, the mick out of uh, Scientology? So he, uh, he withdrew his musical services. Uh, Grindle, uh, let me have a look. Just reach the list. Okay, not not devastated with that. It's it'd be better if they weren't stunned, but it's not not the end of the world. 
Um, you're not desperately <coughs> near the top, if I'm honest, Grindle, but the good news is we will be... We have to make a new Chaos team, Andy, is that correct? Yeah, we do have to make a, new, a brand new team. So there'll be a new Chaos team, um, so that and might just, and just about pick you up there. And I, yeah, great. And two things, Grindle. He's been around a, a lot recently, so I'd like to obviously, I'd like to see him on the tree, uh, on the tree, on the team. Um, and while we don't go subscription chasing, if someone is subscribing, they're here on the channel. It'd be nice to have them in rather than someone um, who's just said me, me once, and then we've not seen them again for ages. So I, I'd like to uh, bump him up the list certainly. Oh no, actually, mate, we do need to set up a Patreon account. Um, what I'm hoping to. I'm hoping to buy Tuco a six pack of Whiskers Super Meat, which is um, two pounds ninety nine. So if we can raise two pounds ninety nine, that'd be brilliant. I'll, <laughs> I'll put the details on later. <laughs> oh dear! I want to make a new, I don't know, building or something. Yeah, let's do it. No, we're not. We're not doing a Patreon account. We don't want to. It's if you want to subscribe, we massively appreciate it. But no, we're done. Cheer your little hearts out and sub on YouTube. But yeah, yeah. cost you now and sub on here if you really want to. That's much appreciated. But um, no, I can't be asked for Patreon. Yeah, Steve Stark. Hello, buddy. How are you doing? <laughs> it's now. It's not three fifty. He left the tree. He's left him down. Oh, hang on a second. One, two, three, four, five, six. Yeah. Right. Let's get the block guy up and running. <gasps> Where have I got hiccups from? What the fuck? Well, you did have toast an hour ago. That could be it, you think? It's outrageous. Yeah, they're not having a good couple of weeks over to another mate. How'd they do last week? I thought Wayne Rooney scored and did quite well. I don't I can't remember the rest of it. We've recently used Oscar on a team, because I've got his name, it's on the list, but we've crossed it out. Is he on the Chaos team? Oh no. Bollocks. Ah, Pablo, no, you, you didn't actually, mate. What you said was line. Uh, you said some sort of lineman or something. So as we made the Chaos team first in your name count, I figured that for Chaos teams, that's that's how um, nearest thing to a lineman. So, no, I, d I didn't get Thrall, mate. I got lineman. <laughs> oh, dear. Pablo. Um, Sorry, Pablo. <laughs> you need to read that. It's quite good. I know. I'll... You want to be a peasant? <laughs> okay. I don't know. Subscribe. Send us like thousands of pounds. That'll probably do it. Oh, a, a sub would bump you right up the list. Hang no, on. no, 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 no. No, we're not doing that. that. No. Sponging money off. Yeah. People. No. 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 Sub won't do anything. You go nowhere. Don't sub. I'll reject Whatever it. Whatever you do, don't. No. <laughs> I don't. <laughs> we're, oh God. We're in a lose lose scenario now. What's happening in the game? Quick, oh, change subject. quick change the subject. Um, Anarian's crowding us. Oh, BZL, I saw Newcastle uh, jumped ahead of um, Arsenal last at the weekend. <laughs> I don't imagine that will happen very often. <laughs> I don't know what you could possibly be talking about, Hellboy. Remember, 299. <laughs> 
<laughs> so, so, <laughs> I, I just got where that reference was. <laughs> you might think that we possibly couldn't possibly comment. It's all just in good fun, isn't it? It's just a bit of bants. Bit good fun. And Arian with That's his move four trees. What the fuck? I was just about to say that tree's got a fair turn of speed when he's motivated, doesn't he? Which tree is that? Is I think, that me? No, I think it's That's the way... That's me the... tree. Yeah, but it's because of the way the wind's blowing. It's pushing him. You can tell. We've got some sort of sail arrangement going. We so. seem to be a bit, um, a bit trapped here. What's going on? Yeah, it's not ideal, is it? Um... Uh, yeah, well, okay, well, you could just push Northwest Halfling out the way, uh, and then blitz the other and leg it. Yeah, that'll be the plan. That will actually be the plan. Probably it, isn't it? Yeah. And you've even got a, a three, a, a free thrall up north, um, for receiving the, uh, potentially thirsty vampire. Oh, is the tree next to it? Oh, the tree's next to it. Oh no, there we go. Oh, Tomo, no, no, <laughs> disaster strikes. It's the lack of rerolls. That's what's absolutely crippling me. I've not even been um, reckless. With, I haven't been reckless at all with them, but. Um, it, it, you can't play vampires all game with one reroll. It doesn't work. Why, why did you reroll the push on the, the first I didn't, fling? I didn't. I rerolled the um, attacker skull both down. Which, oh, I, had to, which I had to I eat looked, last I turn. Looked, yeah. yeah, I had to eat that last turn. Uh, Hellboy, it depends on what team, because... It depends a, a, li a little bit. Um, tackle is a first skill potentially on a on a um, uh, on a beastman or something. Yeah, sure. Um, tackle, generally speaking, blocks very good. So y you can make an argument for one tackle player. Sure. If you start going much above that, it's a bit risky. I, I think I'd probably stick to original plan of team building, but just bump tackle up the desirability order a bit. I, maybe, I, maybe move it ahead of mighty blow for second player. Or it, it depends what team you're building, I suppose. If you had a player with no skills, block would serve you better than tackle would even against um, the agility teams. Oh. I would say. Catnips, thank you for the follow. Welcome to the show. Um, how's this team doing, Asti Stark? Um, pretty eight. well, buddy. This is. I think this is three and zero. I'm sure it is. Is it not three and zero? Maybe it's only two and zero. I don't know. This is it's... the third game. I think. I think. They 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 won all the games basically. I don't think they're going to win this one though. Uh. Probably a draw. It, the, the, the chef has absolutely been. Uh, Chef's been outrageous. Fan, fantastic. How many did he get in the first drive? Two. He's had two out of two out of three and three out of three. Or well, you could simply say that it's five out of six. Yeah. Or bollocks. <laughs> uh, Odyssey. No, no. This is uh, champ ladder, mate. This counts. 
We don't we don't do no friendlies now when we've got champ ladder. This is serious. Mm. We've missed you, Stay. We've missed you. But we're we're usually um, probably Tuesday night, Thursday night, Saturday morning, Sunday evening seems to be working reasonably well so far so if um, that helps at all and also do, do check on um, Facebook and um, the Twitch landing page as Andy's been ever so good recently that he's broadly been updating when we're next on most unlike him I know but he's been a very good boy and stay have you seen the Facebook page is there a link below Andy yes well done Link below, Facebook page. Check it out, man. It's awesome. Oh, and um, most of you missed the, the new uh, intro stuff. When when we turn the stream off, do you put the intro stuff on again, or do you just go to, straight to host somebody? Fucking hell, it's nice and shite. Really bad. Oh, oh. <sighs> Fuck's sake. Well, that's a draw. There we go. So that is a draw. Ace looking that way, isn't it? Yeah, no, it is. I can't. I can't stop him now. I physically can't stop him. I had to not. That had to not be shit. Um, yeah. W will it be? Um, I don't know because I've had to delete it because I just couldn't fix the audio quality earlier. <sighs> That's frustrating. That is. I just frustrated because this shouldn't have been a draw, especially after the first half. So was it? Was the intro then? Was that what was causing the audio problem? No. Something on something on the settings of thingy. So, I'm, I'm all confused. On the, tw how, on the how settings of the... no, I couldn't. I didn't know what it was, so I just went and physically deleted it because before it was there, it was fine. So when I, I thought, well, I'll get rid of it, and that might fix it. It wasn't. It was a setting in. Um, uh, setting. Why is what? Hang on a second. My headset's going nuts now. Um, what is going on? You, you're all flustered and angry now, aren't you? Frustrated and annoyed. I'm, I'm, it'll be alright. Yeah, definitely the chef made the difference here, I think. Yep. It wasn't particularly... I mean, the, the flings did what flings do, and chivy and chivy and be in the way and that kind of stuff. But I don't think Inari was fabulously lucky in any way. Um, we really... It was the vamps tripping themselves up with, you know, the, the sort of two, two plus and three plus activities turning over and meh. So, you know, no mind. Uh, Destron off asks, have we already uploaded 110 videos? Yeah, probably. I haven't, I haven't been counting, but I've, possibly more. I'm, I could believe it. Vilnich, good night, my friend. Sleep well. Scored. Oh well. Yeah. Felt like I lost that game. Well, yeah. I, not a massive amount. I think could have really done differently. Right. 
terrific. See? It's, it's, it's almost... It was it, short of playing Amazons. This is one of the worst matchups actually because um, I've got one re well. I had one reroll. I should have had more, but um, we've only got two players with block. No tackle, no mighty blow, no nothing. Just two players with block. So that was that was bloody hard work. Bad news is MVP goes to another throw, but it does level him. So Morbid Orbits gets block or kick or whatever, dirty player, whatever you fancy. Um, now, block. Really financially, um, where do we stand now? Hope so too, Steve. It's, it's not been the same with that. You're merely very similar. Um, I don't want 